Have you ever imagined making buildings out of waste? It's a big claim with limited data, but stick with me and you'll see why. Currently, cement alone is estimated to contribute to around 8% of global carbon dioxide emissions due to the energy intensive calcination process. The current linear model, which is extract, produce, use, and dispose, creates massive waste and environmental damage. Frustrated with the current construction practices, four scientists decided to rethink the way we build. They explored how fungi could transform waste into eco-friendly construction materials by specifically looking at mycelium. Their groundbreaking study titled Growth and Mechanical Characterization of Mycelium-Based Composites Towards Future Bioremediation and Food Production in the Material Manufacturing Cycle does offer a new path for sustainable material manufacturing. They cultivated mycelium on different organic substrates, fine-tuning growth conditions to let the fungus bind to the waste to form robust composites. These living materials then underwent a battery of tests, from measuring their tensile strength to gauging compression resistance, proving that nature's own glue could in the future rival conventional building materials. But what they discovered was quite interesting. Mycelium-based composites reach compression strengths of up to 0.5 megapascals, a promising figure for eco-friendly construction materials. This is roughly the pressure that you'd feel 41 meters underwater. What's even more exciting is that fine-tuning the growth parameters boosted performance by 20 to 30%, suggesting that in the future, we could one day manufacture these at large scales. These results are a step forward in enabling circular economy. It transforms organic waste into valuable composites that could be used for insulation and packaging. Unlike cement, which uses calcination, this uses a manufacturing method with a low energy consumption and carbon dioxide emissions. Now here's what I think. Although existing construction materials currently offer higher strength, mycelium-based composites present an intriguing alternative that deserves further optimization. Although the researchers provide impressive compression strengths, it would be cool to see the material's fire performance to ensure safety for future building applications. Another important challenge that we have to overcome is reproducibility and standardization, as producing materials through natural fungal growth does introduce variation. And now, the meme of the week. Thanks for watching everyone. Don't forget to hit that like button and subscribe for more content. And if you're curious, check out our video on how termites are redesigning skyscrapers.